It's Myth and Moonshine Night here at Skinny B. Johnson Stadium in International Speedway in Gristlejock, Georgia, where you can hear 13 minutes live version of Freebird five times a game, twice on the hour. Pain, suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's going to have it all. The Cincinnati Bengals take on the Yorks of Hazard. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> it's time to tune in, turn on, and drop what you're doing because NFL Game Day is on the air. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. So what's the game plan for the home team today, Bricks? Uh, I think they got to keep it simple. A little cough syrup, maybe smoke a little untidy pod pregame so they can keep their heads in the game. I mean, literally. You don't want to get decapitated on the opening kickoff. I say go after the refs early and often. No mercy. Just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. And the defense jumps outside. And the whistle blows the play dead, along with the quarterback. First and ten. And that's a nice run for a first down. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole! Hey, asshole, up here! Talking to you! Straight through the uprights! <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score! Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. <laughs> Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Well, B, five, folk, and then he jars the ball loose, and it's a fumble. That's what happens when you hurdle and take a hard hit. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Grim. And it's first and ten. Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Oh. 
second down and ten. The defense better look out. The offense called the beast boot dirty trick. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Second down and nine. And he's off to the races. The 20. The 10. Oh, what a run there. Touchdown! No one was going to stop him. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. And he runs it in for an easy two points. The momentum in this game may be shifting. Well, those are just my balls. Hey, thanks for sharing, Rick. <laughs> you want to get some fun on your time. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Second down in a mile. That's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Third down in. The punter is warming up. And he held on to that one for a first down. Hey, man. He's going to hit him now. He almost had And it's first and ten. Oh, and he just turned. Oh, he took a leap and had the ball knocked out. Fumble. He's got a case of fumbleitis. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. Huh? I didn't know that was a penalty. Yeah, these rule changes are ruining the game, Grim. <laughs> First down and less than a yard. Defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten.
Second down and long. And he runs it for four yards. Third down and nine. And they line up for the extra point. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And that pass finds its target. A pickup of six yards on the play. Third down and long. was stuck to him like glue. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And that'll be a touchback. And it's first and ten. Whoa, and he laterals the ball to the player behind him. He is running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. was there but he still picked up a yard somehow second down and nine If you don't kill this ref with the attack ref dirty trick, you're gonna lose, pal. You kind of deserve it if you're this dance, Grim. Third down in the offense, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Third down and 
never going to happen. You can't keep a good mutant down. The offense just burned the defense pretty hard on that one. That is still edible, though. Just got to scrape off the charred parts. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Boom! And it's first and ten. Shit. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection, too! Uh, well, that has weird side effects, Briggs. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, with the brain scrambler. up a two and that'll be second and eight to go Murphy Brown what I mean first down what the hell was that I uh, I honestly don't know Grim And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Second down and two. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And it's first and ten. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit it. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. Smart move there as they call a timeout trying to get the ball back for another shot. And that'll bring up third and one.
You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match. And they'll keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards. Second and the quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. And the quarter look out, that's an all-out attack on the QB. Now the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. Catch that. In a hurry up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And that's a catch for three yards. Third down and three. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Well, either that or kill and cheat more. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig.
second down and four. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. And normally I don't advocate for changing the station, but for the sake of your eternal soul, I'd understand if you want to cut away during this ritualistic dance. Uh, Rim? The, uh, the crowd started chanting. Why, well, uh, yes, uh, <laughs> yes they did. We're, we're going to go ahead and lock the announcer's booth until he's done dancing. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Tired of the quarterback's tight stand. And then on Sportsmanlike Play of the Day, brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's Drive. The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. And that'll be second. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down in a lot. And they call a ginormous dirty trick. He's so big and delicious. Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in midair. It is a fumble indeed. Fumble Vanji! The new game from Wilda Crabtree. Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And perfect pass for two points. That's a piece of art right there, Bricks. Yeah, man, the QB turned the defense into an abject mess. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Friends. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Second down and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And that'll bring up third and one. Go to the ground game and pick up the first. Nicely done. And it's first and ten. Oh, look at this guy break. Oh, what the brutal hit. Second down and seven. Third 
third down, and the punter is warming up. And he can pick up a nice chunk of yards on that pass play. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. And the punter has one job to do, and that's punt the ball. Preferably further than that. It stacks when they let the punt drop, and it will be down by the defense. And it's first and ten. Well, fee five fo fum I am not finishing that joke, Grim. The only low-hanging fruit is on that ginormous mutant, if you know what I mean. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my... And the defense goes for the jugular and rushes to kill the court. You know, if he was still talking, he'd probably be saying, Psycho killer, Keska say, what the fuck, the fuck, the fuck? And it's first and ten. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. <laughs> first down and forever. Second down and seven. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very long. Devastating hit knocks the ball loose. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. They're gaining on him. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. And he runs out of gas and got tackled short of the goal line. Hell of a run, though. Uh, I like this damn it happens to a lot of guys, Glenn. Uh, at least that's what I hear. You want to get some fun on your time. Quarter three comes to an end, but this game is far from over and will be decided in the final quarter. And it's first and ten. And the ball is lateral to his teammate. We're talking street. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. And the ball hits the field incomplete. He threw it when no one could catch it. Some things like that in the quarterback. Second down and ten. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stomped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you'd think. Touchdown! And he rumbles that one into the end zone. Nicely done! I can't run like that unless it's coupon night and time.
Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. And it's first and ten. the way to move the chains that's good for a first down this game is all about momentum and killing and it's first and ten and the quarterback finds his man for the first down and it's first and ten They want more points, so they're going for two. And he plows forward for the two point conversion. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. Not much there, maybe a yard. Second down and nine. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Third and four. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. Ah, and he laterals at the last second. Nifty move there. Full man about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. First down and three. The Orcs of Hazard had their butts, hands, and heads handed to them today. They lose by forfeit. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say chimp?
choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. God, that was beautiful. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...